My next guest has made some bold claims. I am your god. <laughs> That's about as bold as it gets. Judd Butters is a 30-year-old man who claims he is the creator of our existence. Do I have that right? Not me, not Judd Butters sitting here before you. This is just an avatar, a digital approximation, if you will, of what I look like in the real world. The world beyond this world. So this isn't reality? No. <laughs> you may have heard of an ancestor simulation. Now correct me if I'm wrong, but isn't that the theory that this existence is just a simulation of what might have occurred to an advanced civilization in their past? Uh, sort of The Sims, and we here on Earth are all just non-player characters that were spawned in that simulation. Exactly! Your lives are all part of a simulation I created. So while the details of your reality aren't exactly like ours, it's a way for us to have a glimpse into how other societies and universes can develop. Do you have any way to prove this? Uh, let's see... How's that? What just happened? I turned off your existence. You and your entire reality were deleted and then undeleted. Wow. This raises so many questions, an unfathomable amount. No, I generally don't deal with the day-to-day -day stuff. I don't hear your prayers. You're made in my image to a degree, but I mess something up and you only have one set of genitals. I am not responsible for cats. Elvis was never alive. D.B. Cooper never left the plane. Annabeth, your keys are on top of the fridge. The Many Worlds Theory is just an add-on of other similar simulations being networked together. Yes, I can elevate you from this existence to real reality, but I won't do it. It gets messy with the robotic bodies and explaining why we all have so many extra holes and poles and how to use them. Wow. I know I'm saying that a lot, but uh, this is a lot to take in. But I suppose the only real question is, why did you make us and why are you revealing yourself to us now? I like to watch a lot of TV in the real world, and there's just not enough shows. Never enough good quality programming. I thought I could create a reality and watch the shows from there. And things were really starting to heat up these last few years, and I was loving it. So many amazing things to watch. That's great that you support the creative community. Well, it isn't all great. Netflix? Stop canceling everything after one or two seasons. I have invested a lot of time and energy not only into watching your shows, but the creation of your very existence. You are testing my patience. Specifically, I would like to know what happens in the OA. I made you, I can unmake you. And I may do that an infinite number of times and scour all the realities for a version where that show finally does reach a conclusion. I think there are some executives that had better listen to these warnings and give Judd, the creator of all, exactly what he wants. Judd Butters, thank you for joining us and for creating us. Glad to be here. If God can't bring back the OA, who can? We'll be right back with the fascinating story of a man whose toupee ate his wife. That's next on Across All Galaxies. <laughs> 